All right. Welcome back to Analondo, ladies and gentlemen. Our next step, Gwendolyn. Main reason, really. Um, he has sunlight sword, which I know I can't equip since I've enchanted this. Well, I know I can't use since I've enchanted this weapon, so it's kind of pointless. And is this coming up or what? But um, I still want to do it. So while this is going down, I'm gonna unequip this, and I'm gonna equip the Dark Moon Seance Ring. Because if you don't have that equipped, well, you won't see it. You won't see the the thing. This is actually a covenant, and it is the ideal covenant to join if you are a faith spell sword, uh, because the Dark Moon Blade is freaking awesome. Um. So it's also an alternative alternative way to get uh, the sunlight blade. If you kill him, you get the sunlight blade. So either way, if you join the covenant, or if you kill him, you will you can get a really really good, um, like buff. One of the best in the game, power buff, like damage buff. That said, I'm going the wrong way. That said, um, if you're like me and you suck at PvP and you want um, a way to farm them. Then the crows in the um, painted world will drop what you need in order to rank up in the covenant, um, which are souvenirs of uh, souvenirs of appraisal for. Um, let's see if we've done this right. Which are souvenirs of rep appraisal for um, this covenant? You need eighty of them, I believe. I think I've done it once before. All right, down here. Down here is the secret. There's another bonfire. And because I have that ring equipped, this disappears. So then. Ring of the Sun's Firstborn. And that's what this is. This is... Halt! This is the tomb of the great Lord Gwyn. Tarnished it shall not be by the feet of men. I like if thou art a true disciple of the dark sun, cast aside the <clears> denial. <throat> Hear the voice of mine self, Gwendolyn, and kneel before me. <laughs> no. Um, sure. I'm the, um... Like, I'm, I'm not a worshipper. I'm sorry, dude. Um, in fact... I'm a dragon man, um, the dragon man of light. So I will kneel though, just to see if you have a gesture. O oh, disciple of the dark yeah. sun, thou hast journeyed far. Hear my voice. If thou shalt swear by the covenant to become a shadow of Father Gwyn and Sister Guinevere, a blade that shall hunt the foes of our lords, then I shall protect thee. Safeguarding thy person with the power of the Dark Moon. Oddly enough, both Gwyn and Guinevere are shadows of their former selves, quite literally. Well, Very well. not Gwyn. We shall not need speech. Exit here and follow thine own design. <clears throat> okay. So this is Gwyndolin. He is Lord Gwyn's firstborn. A boy. But because this is an incredibly sexist world, he was raised as a woman because um, he was born with a gift for magic, which is apparently feminine. They're like, all right, boy, you're good at women things. You're not a man, you're a woman. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> he has some pretty cool armor, though. Robes, really. The dragon have Foolishness. light. That's cut. Why trespasseth upon the great lord's tomb, whilst thou art a disciple of the dark sun? But I'm not. Mark the words of mine self, Gwendolyn. I am a thou disciple. Not go unpunished. I am a disciple of the stone dragon. I am old guy, the ancient dragon of man on deadness. All right. This guy has hacks. You'll see what I mean. He has hacks. 
<laughs> Got him once. I'm not. Uh, say hello to this fight, ladies and gentlemen. That is the entirety of this fight right there. Oh. Yeah, that is the entirety of this fight right there. Damn it. That gets much harder to dodge as you get close to him. Thankfully, he doesn't have that much in the way of defense. He's very much a glass cannon. Oh! I forgot that goes through walls. Damn it. No worries. <clears throat> we can do it, no problem. There is my souls. Arrows. When he stands up like that, he's most likely gonna. Oh wow! Yeah, when he when he kind of tilts up on his um, tentacles, um, he's gonna shoot the arrows. So there we go, my souls. Shame, but I already spent a bunch of them, so it doesn't really matter. Um, let's turn into a dragon again. All right, what's he gonna do? Well, first of all, he's going to teleport away. I'm going to pick this up, otherwise it's going to annoy me. Right, he's going to shoot me with soul arrows. Which, unfortunately, hit me. More soul arrows. Damn it! Really? Bollocks. <laughs> Wasn't paying attention. I looked away for a second. No!
God damn it, Gwendolyn. upon thee. Soul of Gwendolyn. Right, with that done, um, let us go at the top here and... Let us open things. Mainly a thing. This thing. Miracle Sunlight Blade. Now I don't actually think I can equip that because I already have an enchanted weapon. I think that only works on Roar. Um, so. Over one here. Which doesn't have anything in it. And I don't think the one here has anything in it either. Oh, look. oh, it does. Hmm. Brass armor. In fact, I believe that is what um the, the fire keeper in this area is wearing. Right then. So I believe now what I need to do is I need to get this 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 bow up to a plus ten version. At which point I can ascend it into um a dark moon bow, which is what I'll use for the rest of the game. It's nice to have a decent bow. <laughs> Vengeance! Oh, that was so satisfying. How's it going, buddy? Good, good. God damn it. That means I've got to run back to um, the other dude um, in the the shrine or whatever it's called and upgrade it a little bit further. So. <laughs> oh, wow, that could not be any more perfect. yourself. Alright, time to run back to the dragon, I mean, the giant blacksmith. Or walk back even. So it was you, was it? How hmm? dare you produce a blade upon a deity? How did you ever get this far? I shall end your suffering here and now. But no, it's no. The least that I can do. But I, I did it for the bow. Don't tell me you worship that guy. I mean, okay, he's really, really powerful, and he has nice fashion sense. But come on, fine. Come at me. Come at me. But how? Harry is a threat, threat. Master Quindlin. I keep a soul for me then. Well, I can't use this bonfire anymore. Goddamn religious people. Oh, I mean, okay. He's powerful. He has uh, an okay voice. A little bit whiny, but an okay voice. He has nice fashion sense. He has tentacles if you're into that. You know, and he's the, the son of 
somebody people worshipped as a god. Because he was fucking huge. I get it. I get it. But still... The Dark... The Dark Moon Bow. I mean... <laughs> you can understand my reasoning, right? The Dark Moon Bow. 